According to my estimate, there's supposed to be about 385 trophies there in uh, DJ Gruz's room. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're all fake. I'll go back to a hat in time. Previously, Conductor was the winner of the 43rd Bird Awards? I'm guessing. There has to be at least 43, right? But then he turned into a big poopy jerk. Trophy wasn't good enough for him. No, he wanted to keep something all to himself. One of our timepieces. So we had to teach Xander Mobis a little bit of a lesson. A lesson in explosions, the proper way, the non-movie way. So now we can move on to that next area the game's bugging us about, but... First, let's check the journal. Considering we were taken hostage last time and we didn't get to complete the award ceremony until we properly completed the war, ce uh, the war ceremony. Yes, that's what we're calling it now. I know, right? It's like they got it off humans or something. Maybe this is Earth in a far, far future where birds take over and there's only Mafia left. Well, hack kids having second thoughts about being in show business, I guess. So, we got riffs to do over in the bird section. And I definitely want to do the story rift and properly get all the pages this time. They're not really pictures, they're more like story pages. Oh, I saw something interactable there, too. What is this over here? Jukebox! Yes, very top of the line! Oh, I love that one! You'll never know which one it was. So, we got rifts here. But I'm more interested in the rifts over here. Oh, that ain't the rift I wanted to go to. No, abort! I don't want to go to Snake. Then again, we could always go and do the blue rift in here. Kill two birds with one stone, if you don't mind the bird murder parlance. It's on a green awning somewhere. That was not it. I was suggested not to do that in this particular level, but hey, we're here, we might as well do it. Blue Rift! We're doing Blue Rifts now. Welcome to the moon! But is this like the DuckTales the moon? Do 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 no, this is just an advanced snake level, and apparently you could wear different hats with this outfit. But I like the bird hat. In fact, wear the bird hat. Maybe not on the cookies. Now wear bird hat. Oh, you don't got it here either. Well darn! Yeah, we got a snake following us. So you can't really double back in this one. And we have to hit switches. Oh, that's bad. Haha, <laughs> I fell! Also, owls! I forgot about those. I might die in a blue rift for the first time ever. Yeah, you're supposed to slide a little bit. Gotta keep moving. The owls demand it. They demand movement. So that allows us to open this over here, I think. Die for it! Not afraid of long jumps in this game. Not only have dive and double jump. Now this is gonna be bad. Whoa! That was almost very bad. Need a heart pawn on this level, I think. These rifts are getting dangerous. All you have to do is add owls and it's more dangerous. They're gaining on me, I hate it. Oh, this again. Yeah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> we died in the blue rift! How did that happen? Oh, wow, we gotta do that all over- Oh, I was about to say! 
Gotta do that all over again? Are you crazy? Nah, no, they're only slightly crazy here. Gears for breakfast. No, I'm going this way this time. You know what? I can't even go this way. In fact, I changed my mind. Yes, we can go this way. I'm gonna freak out the camera while I'm doing it. You get run over by owls while I was messing with the camera. Looks like we're gonna have to go to lower route if we want to go back without getting killed by a snake. Made out of owls. I am rather impressed with these guys who keep up hack it, actually. Especially when things like that happen. Like, how were they even clearing that? There's a laser light show over there. I'm starting to not like this level. Alright. Ah, I have the no bonk badge, but it doesn't help me here. How did I do this last time? When I did it in the, the Dead Bird Studios, which is just like the last video ago. I can't even remember what I did. I know you got a du double jump underneath the gate. There we go. I remember it is called diving. Now it's time to take the high road. Yeah, these aren't all easy peasy like the last ones were. This one, you really have to know what you're doing. Yeah, slight opportunity! Can't kill me now, Snake. I'm invincible. Nano machine, son. Oh, yeah, we get to roll for more bird hat. I hope we get bird hat. Let's go! Ow. That's not a bird hat. I see it there. The red one. No, it's not Christmas yet. We're not even on Halloween. It's like in another month and a half. Yeah, I'm forced to take it. But I don't need to equip it. All the different variants of the hats will be on your hat page, so you don't need to worry about, like, overriding... Here we go! What are you doing here? Shoo! Seriously, you're taking forever. Just get away from me. We have another intruder alert! We completed three levels. Mustache Kid is back. Alright, I'm in. I made it. I infiltrated that kid's spaceship without the alarms going off. Actually, we can see you on the cameras, so we're just not doing anything about it. I bet she's collected a ton more timepieces than I have. Now, where does she keep them? She's been leaving messages through for like, the whole game. I think there was one in the last video, if you can see it. But we get to play as the Mustache Kid. She operates just like the Hat Kid, except she has a mustache. Look at that poopy jerk. I hate her the most. She can't even emote. Yeah, she has cooler stuff than you. Take that out. She has an Earthling sitting device. You can't enjoy it. I ain't gonna help you find them. Why would I help them find you? Why would I help anyone find you? Wait a second. I didn't think that through clearly. You can't even ladder correctly. Come on! Useless. Absolutely useless. She doesn't even ladder. Mustache Kid can't ladder. She could crawl, though, so she's better than Metroid. Yeah, she's got 25 of them. More than halfway there. Jackpot! This must be where she stores them all. Well, she has some padlock, though. You'll never get in. Time Wait a second. To mess with time a little. What are you gonna do with those? Besides the evil. That doesn't mess with our total, right? Oh, that's bad. Mustache kid is up to no good. That doesn't really alter the planet at all, though. I don't know what she did. Everything seems okay to me. We can open this area, but then again we also have that lore rift to do. So we might as well do that one. Figure, so we don't see her for a long time and then she hatches some kind of evil plot. 
Alright, we gotta go there to Dead Bird Studios to get this lore rift. Is it gonna be open or closed? This is the better question. Are these guys working on number 44? Yes, they are. Same old, same old. Now what are they arguing about? This movie studio is too big for the both of us, DJ. Get it? You. Oh, it's the same Not argument. What? No. Conduct a doll. Please shine. Let me skip. Well, thank you. Ah. <sighs> same crap, different day, huh, guys? Welcome, young one. Oh, we could finally buy laser. We don't want the poopy badges, especially that one. It kills you instantly. Give us the laser. We want the laser. Waited long enough for it. Even though laser isn't all that fantastic, but it is a Super Mario RPG reference. Have you come to anything else? No. All right. Laser badge. Overwrote my magnet badge and not the no bonk badge. Laser does this. And you can charge it. Just wait a little while. Hold it in. You get super laser. We could use this in the movies. It looks a lot like the Geno laser from Super Mario RPG. That's why I mentioned it. So we don't need to mess with the lore anymore around here. The story. Just need to get in. Someone put the thing back in place. Oh, we're getting billed again, but I know Conductor will cover it, right? I mean, really, DJ Grooves isn't going to do anything about it. We almost got caught by Penguin. Good thing we had some iframes there. Let's make this movie it's not too far into this level, though, so we don't have to mess around with too much. Except for, you know, falling off pipes. At least we get a little bit more Metal Gear Solid. It's over here, ain't it? It's up in this section. Yeah, there it is. Now let's see what's going on between these two. I have a little notepad here telling me how many pages are in each area, so I know how many I need to get. And here's the old warehouse! And the first page! Well, that was easy. And we've been down in here. Old Dead Bird Studios. That's what I'm calling it. That camera is watching for miscreants. Also, someone said this uh, sign reminds them of something. Like, pizza. When I read Conductor, I think pizza. I think there's two pages available in here, so we gotta keep an eye out for those. So you have to have an eagle eye, just like a bird. We're good at that kind of thing. This camera, however, does not have the eyes of a bird. Maybe a drunk bird. Ah, there's a page now. That's one. And there's the other one. Also, we need more rip ponds. Maybe I won't collect all of them. I'll just collect the required ones. Especially when they're out of the way, like that one down there. That's two of them here. This big area is gonna have three of them in it. Sneaking music. Cameras. Guarding rift ponds. That's gonna be difficult. And here I go getting lost again in here. Looking at all the stuff I could put on eBird. There's Rift Ponds out there too. Yeah, let's head out there and get that. You know, just floating speakers. That says movies in my book. And I see another page down there. Oh, that's not a page. That's a pawn. Starts at the letter P though. I think this is the page. And there was another one up here somewhere. More platforming for us. It's high. It's very high. Well, that's two. There's one more to grab. Brewing hat, go! 
There's a rift pond in there. Did you see it? I see another rift pond. I, it, if I was hiding a page, I would hide it somewhere up on top of these things. Hidden in the corners. I don't want that rift pond. It's guarded by the cameras down there. Keeping an eye out for pages. They have a different shiny than the rest of them. Yeah. Could be over here, but there's camera in the way. Right, where's the hidden sandbag? I don't think we can get up there. Where would I hide a page here? Again, that's that rift pond down there. Grab this while we're here. And fall to our deaths. Yeah, that's great. This stage has some heart bonds in it though, so that's good. I would have hidden the page back there. But that would have been too close to the other page, wouldn't it? Three. I have to have six when I leave this area, if we want to get the whole story. Nice camera you got there. Nice pecking camera, Hong Kong. That's a goose for nice pecking camera. Hmm. Page, where could you be hiding? I want the page. You can't keep me from it. Okay, that was weird. That was some weird jumping. Ah, there's the page! I jumped right over it! I can't believe I jumped right over it! Now I need Rift Ponds. I think we're gonna have to go over here for Rift Ponds. I'll get on top of that thing and see what we could do. Otherwise... Uh, oh, actually I have four Rift Ponds. Never mind, I'm not grabbing the difficult ones. To some panels. There's only one page in this giant place. Whoa! Also, owl harassment everywhere you go, everywhere you look. What was that double jump? That was an anemic double jump. Heck, he's losing a rump. Jump farther for it. Thank you. I think we need five for this one. So I think I'm gonna go out of my way and grab some more rip finds. That's not how you do it! Again, control is failing me! That's two... That one ain't gonna work. That's too high up. Some very Metal Gear sounds going on here. Right, funky jumping for the win. Until it doesn't win anymore. What's the purpose of being down here? Eh? I ask you. There's the page for this area, at least. I was trying to jump around the cameras. Maybe there's an easier way to do this. I don't see one. These owls aren't very receptive on the site. Not too great at it. That's what I meant to do, right there. There's a switch over here. And there's probably a switch in this direction as well. Oh, that's a dweller. That's a dweller thing. We haven't seen that in a while. It's almost like you would have to go to the third area and get a dweller mask to do this one. It sounds like we have enough rift ponds. I'm gonna make extra sure. All of them are activated. Yeah, we could be doing that other level. That new level that we could open up today. But why? That level stinks. I mean, look at what we got here. There is one page hidden in here. Gee, I wonder where it might be. It's where we went before. There's the final page. Sneaking through old dead bird. Old dead bird. Wow, that sounds terrible. We're gonna laser beam this thing. And explode it. I said explode it. It's harder to hit this thing with a grenade because it doesn't home in. 
ultimate laser. Well, that makes number 26. It replaces some of them that that mustache kit broke. And now let's learn about conductor and grooves. Big dreams. Two different birds on two different sides of the world. One on the moon. One in the west. Both interested in movies. Ah, they learned from an old director too, huh? They want to win. So you're going to need a studio for that, right? Problem. They don't like each other. One studio, two movies. Geez, no wonder. That explains a whole lot with the whole studio thing. Why it's not closed off. They probably have noise through, like, their whole movies. But I'm interested in something bird-like. Give me that bird hat. Where is the bird hat? I demand a bird hat. I see several reds in that reel. And I get none of them. Ridiculous. As soon as there's going to be commons and reds in here. Fine, I'll take it! Minty Fresh! Well, we got a new color to be for the next area, at least. Even though it's already 21 minutes in. Uh, I might as well open it up so you can see what's going on in there. That area. Finally, the game will stop bugging us about it. This is Minty Fresh. It's a more muted version of the Tingle outfit. Which is... Fitting, considering this is the more muted version of all the levels. It's the basement! Alpine Skyline! It belongs in the basement, if you ask me. Ah. There's more going on in the basement, though. We got this. There's science in here. We need the Dweller Mask into it. I'm not quite sure why Hackett built that. But this opens up yet another area. Might as well boop this, too. It requires 20. This one is the storage room. Yakuza Metro! That's a DLC stage. We'll be doing that after we finish the regular game. Also, there's a time rift in here. And there's another relic part. Which we could do, but eh. Yakuza Metro is going to be, like, one of the last places we go to. This one over here is going to be the very last place, because it requires 35 time pieces to open. So we got to go over into here. This is the washing room. Or, leads to the washing room anyway. You can tell there's a lot of washing going on in there. And this is the basement, where the power is stored. Maybe you don't want to hit that lever anyway. The emergency button! Well, it's a good thing we have plenty of buttons to push, including Corgi Quest 7. But welcome to Alpine Skyline! This one's a little bit different. It has no stages. All it is is a big hub world. It's my least favorite stage because it's like free roam. I should like that, but it's very plain. All the other levels are like silly or spooky silly. This one's it's a bit more tame, kind of spiritual. It's like total tonal whiplash. Also, the whole free roam thing is about to become apparent a little bit. Think Breath of the Wild, but in platformer. Open up. We're here to see the forest god. We need to tell him he's been poisoned. That's an obscure reference, even for this channel, because that game's supposed to be a supplementary to another game. Ah, spiders again, and they're laser-proof! Why are they laser-proof? 
the laser didn't hit him properly. The hitbox is weird. Also, the laser doesn't home in like grenades can. Dangerous mountain! What is this, Mount Ariat? Are we gonna go fight Bale now? That's what I said about Tonal Whiplash. Creepy and spiders. Creepy spiders. It's like we're gonna go have an epic battle somewhere in Asgard. And Mumiza's gonna be there. She's gonna be like, yeah, I have Molnir and it's cool. You'll like it. Hey, what happened to my... Ah, okay. Magnet's working. Never mind. Time to solve the Zelda puzzle. Yeah. Gonna whack all of these things. I'm not quite sure what they do, but they're in our way. Don't mind the ominous lightning. I'm sure it's nothing. Did we do a good? I guess so. You don't need to hold X for this. Man, where are we going? The Skyloft? The uh, Dalam? There's another Sky Kingdom I forget? I don't know. Now, this is where we're going to be spending the next two or three videos. It's a shorter section, actually, when you think about it. Look at all that stuff. Remember what I said about Breath of the Wild? You see, we've got a birdcage, we got clouds, and we got lava, and lava, and lava lava. Well, here we are. Welcome to the Alpine skyline. All that, all you get is more mountain. And bouncy things that don't work properly. And this dude. Welcome, young one. Yeah, he doesn't really sell anything anymore. We have all the good badges. Even though he didn't say a line that I was hoping he would say by now. Welcome, young one. Yeah, he's not gonna say it. Ah. Well, we'll see him again. Eventually. Soon. So this is free roam. You can go wherever you want. If you head that way, you'll end up at the birdcage. Also, there's some side areas you can do. Some of them are mandatory, some of them aren't. There's the giant windmill. There's the lava cake. And... Where was it? Yeah, you blow horns open up roots. The, the Jawa people like to talk a lot. Well, there's a yarn here, at least. Especially a new kind of yarn. The Time Stop yarn. We can control time itself. Eventually. We need... Six more. So that's gonna be a little while yet. Also, there's these big yak fellas. Just hanging out. I thought the little Jawa girls, these here... Are, I thought they were like the, the baby version of these guys, but apparently they're just Jawa people. There's the Twilight Bell. You can look around at it. Not too far, though. At least they don't charge us. It's not a very good tourist spot. We could do this anytime we really feel like it. We could go back to the hub. We could go do other things. We gotta complete this level sooner or later. If we want all the time pieces. Especially if we want to get to the last DLC area that requires 30, 35. Good night, folks.